Hi, I'm Emily, Programs Manager at Tech Returners. We have just announced our latest Your Returns Tech program starting in December this year in partnership with Booking.com. And we are so excited to be working with them again. Today, I'm joined by Austin Shepherd, Vice President of Engineering at Booking.com, who will be answering some of our questions. Hi, Emily. Yes, I am Austin Shepard, VP of Engineering for Booking.com for trips, which we call everything but the stay at Booking.com. I've been here for about five months and I've heard amazing things about this tech returners program as Booking.com had the chance to work with you in the past in 2019. So we are very happy to return to the tech returners program. Thank you. So why is our Your Return to Tech program important to Booking.com? Great question. And there's no, no one answer, no easy answer, because there's so many things that make it important to Booking.com. But I'd, I'd start with probably first and foremost, it's just the right thing to do, really. Uh, do the right thing is one of Booking.com's core values that we talked about internally and externally all the time and I really do believe, we really do believe that this is the right thing. At Booking.com, we're committed to building and developing a diverse tech workforce. And this is a really incredible program to help with that. It's not an easy thing to do, as, as I'm sure you know, build out a diverse workforce within tech, but this is a really unique program, type of program that I've never had an opportunity to, uh, to, to leverage in my 22 years in the tech industry that I'm, I'm super thrilled about. Um, so it's gonna help with that. A very big reason that we're so excited about this program in particular is that it specifically is just such a great source of both women and underrepresented minority tech talent, um, talent that is, is wonderful. That's amazing. But, uh, it's, it's, it, there's just tons of barriers for that type of talent to come through traditional recruitment channels. So, um, this is a great way to break through some of those barriers. Um, those that have taken some career breaks for any number of reasons, personal, professional, or otherwise, they've got even more barriers stacked against them than, than they even would have in the first place, being a woman or, or, or being somebody with a, a non-traditional background. There's, there's just so many reasons that, that talent from this particular cohort already has obstacles that make it hard to break in to the workforce where, where they really can thrive and belong if, if, if they're given a chance, right? But if your CV shows that you've been away from the workforce for a few months or a few years, for whatever reason, it's, it's even more impossible, right? To, to, to get back into that, that, that workforce where you might just be amazingly successful if given that chance. So this, this helps with that. I firmly believe uh, just both from my own experience as, as well as just things that I've, I've seen around me in, in, in my life is, that our lives are not linear. We can't really plan them out perfectly, right? And if lives aren't linear, why should career paths necessarily have to be linear as well? I, I don't believe that they have to be. You don't have to have a predictable and straight up to the right kind of career path in order to be amazingly successful within within a field, within a company, within your own career, how, however you decide to define that. And some great advice that uh, a family member of mine, a, a great uncle of mine gave me when I was kind of breaking into my career uh, many, many years ago is, is he said, Austin, don't be too worried about um, what you're setting your foot into doing right now because you're not making irreversible decisions and our lives are long enough for most of us to have three or four different careers, right? Um, so I, I think that's true. I, I hope that the people coming through this program do have an opportunity to either switch careers or get back to that career that they, they want to continue after having put it on pause for a while for, for other reasons. And what does success from the program look like to booking.com? There are lots of ways that I expect that we're going to get some success out of out of this program. And it's not just one, um, but I, I'd say I'd start with just 
a better workforce. We're gonna, through this program, have more people in our workforce that have amazing skills and experiences and talents that we just don't have already. And it would be hard to find and tap into otherwise, All right? This should help us to build a more diverse workforce. We're, we're always looking for ways to increase our diversity, especially increase the uh, representation that we have of of women in, in technology in our workforce. And uh, th this is this is an amazing opportunity for us to really kickstart some of that. Um, not only having a just a, a more diverse workforce, whether it's it's gender or other diversity, but diversity of experiences and the life experiences that can be part of why people have decided to return to a field after having taken a, a life or a career pause for whatever reason, um, that makes us stronger too. Um, having having that diversity of experience and of, of background, um, both of those help. Uh, in addition to just the great people and diversity that, that we get out of this too, though, it's it's also an opportunity for us internally here at, at Booking. It's, it's going to provide some mentoring and coaching and leadership opportunities for for some of the folks that we have internally that will be participating in the program and, and mentoring and coaching the participants in it. Um, so that's that's gonna make uh, the, the existing incumbent workforce stronger too. So it's just a virtuous cycle of, uh, of, of talent and workforce uh, development and improvement. So um, super excited about the opportunity to see success in, in all of those ways and, and hopefully participate in this program uh, many more times to come in the future. So Austin, um, what can our returners expect within a software engineering role at Booking.com? Booking.com is an amazing place to work, uh, especially as a software engineer, somebody in, in the tech field. Booking.com is one of the original pioneers of e-commerce and the internet as, as we know it. It was, it was one of the first big successful companies to come out of the mid to late 90s internet and uh, e-commerce boom. So they kind of started the field as, as we know it now, not only the internet, but online travel specifically. And it's one of the most recognizable brands in the world as well. All of that is cool. But Booking.com is not just resting on its history and, and its name recognition and its brand alone. Booking is building new exciting products and technology every day. We're still evolving our business and our product market fit. The, the, the travel world is changing. COVID, the pandemic has, has changed the way that we think about and plan travel. Um, the barrier of entry into the online travel agency type of uh, market is, is, is low compared to what it was back in the 90s when, when booking started, right? So it's, it's a very competitive marketplace and, and things are changing all the time. We do so much more now on, on our phones with, with handheld apps down and, and we can do more kind of um, on the fly in real time and get, uh, get, get very relevant recommendations from machine learning models that help us uh, to, to have just better, more convenient lives uh, through technology. Booking is, is part of that. We're, th those are the types of things that we're building for our customers right now. So you can be a part of uh, not only being you know, with one of the greatest names in internet history, but with, with a name that's continuing to push that envelope from a product and a technology perspective. So you'll be working with, with modern technologies, you know, um, cloud technologies, uh, mobile app technologies, big data, artificial intelligence, machine learning, really cool technologies um, at a really big global internet scale. You know, we're, 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 we're one of the few companies that, that operate at this scale and that do it with, with such a serious concern for diversity, for humanity, for, for well-being, for, for respect. I've worked at some big names in technology over the course of my career, globally known big names and lots of really interesting places to work, uh, but none of them can compare to the internal culture for respect and humanity and doing the right thing 
and uh, inclusion and, and dignity, all of those things are just the way that we live our lives and work together at Booking that, that make it an even better place to work than any of the other places that, that I've, I've been able to, to spend my career. Um, this is a company that you can be proud to work for whilst you're learning and doing amazing things in the technology and product space. And not only are you going to de develop as a, a great technologist here and uh, have a wonderful career path as a software engineer, but you're gonna work in a company that cares for you as a person, work with coworkers that, that treat you with just amazing dignity and respect. And, and we also absolutely value and practice work-life balance. So you can have a life outside of your career at the same time that you're growing your career. That's not lip service that we're paying uh, here at Booking to, to balance. We actually live it. Why is diversity and inclusion really important at Booking.com? Well, a one-dimensional workforce is not good for the business at the end of the day. It's not good for employees and it's not good for our customers. So striving for better diversity, inclusion, it's, it's, not, it's not only doing the right thing, which is the most important reason, but it's just downright better business too. It, it really is. Having more perspective, having more backgrounds, having more experience internally helps us to just see more angles of the problems that, that, that we get every single day. Um, you can't keep solving a problem the same way with the same set of inputs and backgrounds and experiences and move forward. Sometimes that formula will work in the short or medium term, but it doesn't work in the long term. You, you need diversity of, of experience and perspective, and, and it helps from a behavioral model. It helps from a, um, a balancing of different communication and leadership styles model. It helps from so many different perspectives, and, and it also helps us understand and empathize with our customers better too, right? Booking, um, booking strives to, uh, to reach everybody as a customer, right? And, and what our core product is, is international travel, right? People going from one country to another country for the purpose of having cultural experiences and leisure and, and, and having fun. And, and that in itself is an appreciation of diversity, right? Um, we are headquartered globally in Amsterdam, Netherlands, which is a, a hub for international talent from all over the world. Most of the people that we hire um, in, in Amsterdam are international relocation uh, hires from, from all over the world, different languages, different continents, right? And so that, that's just, it's, it, it's in our DNA, it's in our product, it's, it's in the customers that we reach out to, right? Our, our, our core marketplace where, where we're the strongest is Europe, which is a, um, a, a continent that has so much diversity and, and culture and language and, and everything else. So, I mean, there's there's a million reasons why why it's important. But I'll start with it's the right thing to do, and second, it's just good for business. And valuing diversity and inclusion helps with reinforcing that culture that that I spoke to earlier, the culture of decency and respect and just humanity. Um, you, you can't really have that without also great value and, and appreciation and not just appreciation, but actually living and embedded in the way that you work, diversity and inclusion, right? Which is, uh, I, I believe something that, that we do, not perfectly, but pretty darn well at booking.com. And final question, please tell us why returners can add value to your business. Returners, they're already experienced, right? By, by definition, they're experienced. These aren't people that are just uh, finishing uni or high school, you know, for the first time that are early on in their, their adult lives. These are, are people that have had both career and life experiences already. And, and, and both, um, they've, they've had some depth of experience. And so that's going to add some invaluable, both professional and life perspective to our workforce. 
experience is something that you can't teach. Experience just has to come with exactly that experiences and time, right? And and, and uh, that's that's something that is specific to individuals. So the value that 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 we bring to uh, to booking is is that experience that the returners already have, right? And, and they can share with the rest of us. I do believe that the the types of, of people that are coming through the Tech Returners program are, are likely to be pretty driven, um, pretty motivated, you know, have, have initiative and, um, and, and strength just from having gone through these types of changes in their careers and their lives already. And I expect that's going to provide a spark of energy. Uh, to to booking.com it's going to provide a spark of energy and diverse perspective into the existing workforce that's already here which i'm super excited about um, the returners that come through the program and into booking are going to offer us the opportunity to have amazing high performing high potential tech workers here now part of our company that would be really difficult or maybe even impossible to to find and bring in through the old traditional recruitment methods right so um this is this is a, as great of an opportunity for booking if not better than than it even is for those going through the program um so i i'm super excited that it's it's symbiotic in in, in that way um you know it's 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 something that everybody should benefit from existing workforce company uh program participants and, and even the customers that, that aren't a part of, of our workforce, but they're, they're the people that we're building product for every day. So um, yeah, I, I think that the, the value just expands across so many different angles inside and outside the business. A huge thank you to Austin for answering our questions today. If you are thinking about returning to a career in software engineering and want to apply for our program, please head to our website where you'll see a dedicated program page with the application link. Alternatively, if you have a question before applying, then please do get in touch by emailing hello at techreturners.com. We look forward to hearing from you.